Hi guys, welcome to Classic TV Facts and Trivia. Thanks for being here. Today's video is on Mr. Carol O'Connor, Mr. Archie Bunker himself. Uh, would Carol O'Connor like Archie Bunker if the two met? What do you think? Let's find out. When someone becomes famous for playing a particular character, we very naturally want to know how similar the two entities are. Is the actor similar uh, to the role, or are we deceived by the art of acting? Because we so readily identify these actors with their famous roles, it's common that the two get conflated. It's a big surprise to find out that Carol O'Connor was actually a well-mannered gentleman, far be removed from his on-screen Archie Bunker persona. By all accounts, O'Connor was a good man and certainly not the bigot he played on TV. Even more jarring, O'Connor didn't have that brash New York accent in real life. He was a classically trained actor and his intonation I reflected that. So, if the two aren't actually that similar, what would Carol O'Connor make of a man like Archie Bunker? What would happen if the universes collide and the actor met the character in real life? Would they get along? Luckily for those of us curious about this kind of thing, O'Connor gave his thoughts uh, in 1974. Sure, I'd like him if we met. Um, I feel sorry for him. He's a victim of his upbringing and his environment. But then in 74, Carol O'Connor had grown a bit weary of being so readily recognized as Archie Bunker. Because Archie was a bigot and O'Connor was not, uh, he grew tired of playing such a flawed character. I've become stereotyped now, said Connor. O'Connor. Despite this, though, it was his ability to connect uh, with and relate to Archie Bunker that made On the Family such an iconic series. Archie Bunker could have been a real villain. Instead, Carol O'Connor was able to find the humanity in the character. Carol O'Connor and Archie Bunker hanging out? I wouldn't mind attending a barbecue with them, too. How about you? Wouldn't that would be a fun day? I've, now, mind you, if it was Archie and his family and just me, I probably not. <laughs> uh, me and Archie have very different ideas of things. And me and Meathead as well. We got very, very different ideas of things. And uh, actually, I'd probably fit right into the show. <laughs> That's all I have for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget about classic rock and country music facts and trivia. Head on over there. Check it out. Uh, it's the top 10 uh, highest selling uh, albums, rock albums in the U.S. And some of them might surprise you. Uh, please subscribe. And please don't forget to like this video. Thank you very much. You guys have a great day. God bless. Praying for you.